Well, that was that was a good bit of practice. I'm glad we beat them in the wacky draft, but man, they had some really, really skilled players. And that Dahaka trick was really gross. I feel like my game knowledge got taken advantage of, and that's a bummer. But if I had a dream, it would be that one of us, could be me, gets so good at certain heroes that they don't ban Tracer, or they have to make some sort of choice. Because right now, I don't feel like anything I play is ban worthy enough compared to Mockery's Tracer. And that's, you know, that's a tall order. And the Dahaka trick, yeah. So the way, I, I still don't fully understand it. Maybe somebody can help out. But the way, the way it goes is you target yourself with the dig where you want to end up. You do maybe a shift command or something like that, but it plays the sound where it thinks you're going to go. But because you've targeted or under yourself or something like that, it plays the sound where you would end up, but it cancels the cast. So throughout the game versus Dahaka there, I kept hearing Dahaka appearing in different places, but he actually never dug and still had the dig on cooldown. So he kept tricking us via the audio cue as to where Dahaka was going to appear. And it's apparently very easy to do. And so my game knowledge for listening for Dahaka was actually a detriment versus Dahaka. Looks like I'm going to be offlane here. They took the Zul'jin. I got plenty of range deeps. Pick dive and blinds. We have a stitches, huh? I kind of like the idea of following up a stitches with a thrall. Mr. Peace. If you see inside your own hitbox the circle, you hear the sound. It works when the enemy team is on voice because they call out. So the solo laner thinks Tahaka came back Z and said, yeah. That's gross. Get back on your rel. That's true. I do like your rel. We'll see. Your rel is slow. I feel like she's a little slow. That's my understanding, right? So you cancel your Z because so, there's no cooldown. It's not like, um, it's not a canceled command because that puts you on what? Eight second cooldown. But instead it just instantly refreshes it. So you could still dig somewhere else. Exactly, Torian. Is that legal? I'll make it legal. No, they, 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 I think I think Sammy Hearth trick and all that stuff should be fixed. But I get that it's part of their power pie as the game has gone on. Uh, let's see. Valera. You know, I might Deathwing just to not get eaten by Valera. This Zul'jin would be frustrating because he'd be very easy to hit me. Urel does have a Divine Steed, yes, an instant mount, and it's very fun to do. The problem is a lot of bruisers are very spell dependent, like you have to cast things to live. So the silence and the stun would be really frustrating, which is why I'm now looking at this Deathwing instead. It's not a perfect plan. Looks like we never banned that Ragnaros. I'm going to play Deathwing just so I'm a little more Valera resilient. Yeah, I haven't watched the video yet. What's what's great about him? I know I, I'm fully aware that Thrall is great. I love his poke. I think Lightning's a really good spell. I think that he has the best giant killer kit for a bruiser. That's not, you know, last rites. But I haven't watched the video yet to see what the huge amount of Thrall love is all about. Welcome, Zan. I feel you, Stampa. Hey, I mean, it, it's cool, though, right? Would Imperius have a better giant killer? The problem is his is reliant on hitting that Q in compared to Thrall, which has level one auto attack giant killer, alpha wolf at, what, 16? He's got uh, that ancestral... 
ancestral something something he builds up wrath ancestral wrath I, I know Lee, I know I know Leo's great but I really think with Thrall's level one his level seven and his level 16 that this whole range kit gives him so many options for giant killer that it's not reliant on a hand or a cue that's kind of my if I if I had to bust any giant killer edge I would pick Thrall but he hasn't been in the meta for a bit Yeah, yeah, that, that's definitely my feeling about it. And I love him for countering, you know, things like Sonya or Urel, things that are very hit point reliant in that way. Now, I will have some trouble double soaking. So they do need to keep rotating, particularly if Rag's gonna... Because, uh, you know, I, it's not that I can't. Three people? Three three piz? Wait, did he come back? He did. There's stuff burning bottom. I gotta get out of here. The hour of twilight falls. It, it is actually a worse loan talent. That is true. I'm doing pretty well in the rag, but rag just has that mount ability. And it looks like a blast wave build the way he's casting. A nice little sidestep there. That's fair. I mean, that's not so different than I think most players. Certainly in Dota, there's a lot of one tricks. You got a lot of, you know, people who only want to play one hero in most MOBAs when you get right down to it. Most people don't want to be good at multiple things. I think because of heroes draft and hero pools and the way we understand the draft and how important it is we do draft a little more even than League of Legends and stuff. Right, I'm going to go into space for a little bit. Sadly. They're low, but Sylvanas down. We're just down to burst, so landing in the back line is just going to get me killed.
actual gin kill there. That's good to see. Once I'm done with this wave, let me get rid of these spider dudes too. They just do so much damage. Let's see if we can fly in somewhere. We do have the turn in pressure. Too bad. Something, certainly. Queuing at an angle and missing a minion? Wait, am I? Like one's going untouched by my mighty breath? Oh, I'm so dead. Eh, you know, that could be okay. She doesn't have a heal, though. Okay, Uther, nice. Uh, I think they have it. I think they have it. One slam will do it. Nice. That's something. Nice get there. That'll zone her out. Okay, let's space. I've got fear as well. Alright, I've got fear. Nice have bottom done. Now I can join the team arena. Here comes Sylv. Empowered lane clear. There is a Valera walking around. None can stand in my way. Kinda wanna stick out by Uther. I have borne witness to Oh nice meatball. Nice. That is a lot of gems down. Yep. Top boss is the right call. to know I'm looking at her. I might be able to make a six play here that could totally get me killed, but that boss is quite a bit of health.
Eh. Oh, there's the Valir back here. I'm gonna go space. I'm a little low. that had been inside my stun. Nice. We got bottom. That's not too bad. All right, I want to go back to space for a little bit, though. I'd like to get my armor back so I can have my protections. Let's, let's turn in. I've got 18. I guess I'm just helping his lane clear in some ways. Oh, Sylvanas died. Stand in my way. Feel free to give reasons why the hero is bad on the map. I didn't pick it for the map. I picked it for the Valera so I wouldn't have to get ganked in the off lane. I definitely feel lumbering. Just, he's not wrong, but we also had two dead from other sources. We're decently pushed out, but I think we're going to lose some buildings here. Be a good stun right there. Nice. The fly wasn't the right call there. I should have just gotten positioned for a fear. Kael'thas is going to solo push top. That forward is already gone. Should be okay. I don't think they're in the boss pit. How many do I have? I've got five. 
I'm starting up a boss. That's a good hit. There we go. Just seeing if I can protect Kael'thas. Why are we running around in circles? We can end. This game is ours. Attack the core. GG. GG. What a weird Kael'thas. I mean, he had really good siege damage with his... I guess he did... Ooh. I guess he did full burn flash, sun... Theory of the Sunwell, flamethrower. But what he was doing top there, I have no... Oh, Zul'jin never actually finished his stacks? Scandalous. I died, though. Who didn't die? I guess someone didn't die to Zul'jin. It was just nice to get away from the Valyra. Because so many, so many bruisers are just based on survivability from getting spells off at the right moment. I don't think my build was right, though. We didn't really have... Eh, the Uther was okay, but I really didn't land any conflagrations. I just prefer World Breaker because of the stun, so I probably should have gone Runa Nation. Gone some other stuff. What is the... What is the... What's it called? I think it's Runa Nation. Eh, it's not that great. It's okay. I was hitting some good stuns, but mostly the fear is what got the kills. Convection with only five stacks. Welcome to you, Fibble.